Hello everyone, this is Tuna, and today we are in the early snapshots of Minecraft 1.17 that were released a few days ago. So Mojang finally decided to add a bunch of new stuffs into the game and I'm going to be showing you what can we build with the new blocks and items. So be sure to hit that thumbs up and let's get right to it. So before we proceed to the build hacks, here are the fan arts of the day. Thanks to everyone who submitted and shared their fan art. If you want to send your fan art, make sure to join my Discord server. The invite link will be in the description below. Make sure to read the rules and click the check mark so you can chat. So let's start with something basic. Let's do a candle holder. So this is not my original idea. I have seen this from Reddit. Using lightning rod, you can do a candle holder. If you want a taller candle holder, you can simply do this. So you need two lightning rods in order to do this tall candle holder. And it's up to you if you want to lit the candle up or not. And there you have a candle holder. So this fits in perfectly for cathedral or medieval builds. We used to place pickles on top of pumpkins to make the stem. But now, using the 1.17 candles, we can create a better pumpkin stem. Thanks to Kiaria for sharing me this idea. If you want, you can place a yellow candle to really match the stem of the pumpkin. I think both designs look nice. Did you know a red candle looks like a dynamite, especially when placed on TNT? And yes, this does not explode. You can only use it for decoration purposes. You can place as many red candles as you want, just don't overdo it. Credits to Lucas for sharing me this idea. Before we continue to the video, I noticed that many of you watching aren't subscribed to the channel yet so if you are intrigued and want more epic build hacks in the future then make sure to click subscribe, it's free, and hit the bell icon for notifications. Enjoy the rest of the video! Using a lightning rod with the help of armor stand, we can create an Excalibur or a sword in the stone. So the armor stand is going to be the handle of the sword as well as the lightning rod. And just by pushing it with pistons, you now have an Excalibur. So the top piece of the lightning rod gives you that magical sword design which gives it a detail and I think looks cool. If you want a more simple sword without the need of armor stand, we can use end rod as the sword and any colored candles on top as the handle. Very simple, easy to make Excalibur. Again, thanks to Kiaria for showing me these ideas. This is my favorite build on 1.17. You can create a bicycle with the new lightning rods. So let's start off with the wheels. Now let's make the saddle or the bike seat using armor stands. Push the armor stand to the middle. Don't forget to cover the other side as well. Now place the leather cap, fence gate to the side, and a sign in the fence gate just like that. Now comes my favorite part. Again, do the same just like we did to the other armor stand except this is the front. Push that in the middle. And now we place the lightning rods. Grab your lightning rod and place them like this. Now we want to push that by using pistons. Once you're done, fold the trapdoors underneath and now you have a bicycle in 1.17. I really love the whole build, especially the handlebars on front. It is really nice. Using the new semi-weathered copper block, we can create an old rusty arcade machine. Add an item frame for the screen, and with the help of candles, we can create the joysticks in the arcade machine. How cool is that? 
and there you have a rusty old rusty arcade machine you can also use a lightly weathered copper block if you want a more rusty old arcade machine which looks more cool don't you love the sounds amethyst makes when it's placed and speaking of amethyst you can create a wrapped gift using block of amethyst and a large amethyst bud and since you can place the amethyst bud sideways, you can create a sideways gift design and you can also do a large gift. Let's just imagine the amethyst is shiny so you have a shiny wrapped gift for Christmas. Lightning rods can be used to make a 2x2 table. Simple as that, you now have a lightning rod table design. And again, thanks to my friend Kiaria for sharing this idea. I think candles can be a good cactus flowers. You can also place them on top of a flower pot with cacti on it. Credits to Reddit user PachaQT underscore for this amazing idea. Did you know, lightning rods when placed downwards looks like a hanging rope. And that gave me an idea to make a swing. Start with a 5 blocks high fence. Any fence would do. Place a fence gate in the middle. Then place spruce trap door for the swing chair. And lastly, place the lightning rods upside down. By placing them upside down, you now have a swing. I prefer this than the chain because this rope look gives it a more nature-friendly and perfect for outdoor gardens. And for our last extra build hack, I will be doing an amethyst chandelier. All you need is a block of amethyst and some large amethyst buds on the side. Just like that ladies and gentle fish, you now have an amethyst chandelier. Let's pretend that it is shiny because it really brings in that fancy chandelier look to your house. Very lovely. And there will be more 1.17 snapshots coming soon. I will do a part 2 of this so if you want to see that then make sure to subscribe and share this to your friends. Until then, that is all for today ladies and gentle fish. This is Tuna signing out.